Uh, check it out, guys. I've got an awesome keto breakfast here. Some lovely keto bread made uh, soaked in eggs, so some eggy bread. Some lovely Greek yogurt and some blueberries with a little bit of a rifferto on top. Check out that. Awesome. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Having a lovely little treat here, a non-keto ice lolly called a raffaero. Raffaero. Absolutely freaking delicious. It's so good. It's like a um, bounty sort of thing. And yeah, just finished watching a uh, tipping point as well. It's quite a good uh, quiz show if you want to watch that. Check that out. So yeah, just doing some editing now and uh, yeah, catch up with you later on with the next bit of food or something. So, yeah. so check out guys. I've been a bit busy this morning. Done a bit of editing and everything. Just repaired mum's uh, blender machine here. Blender machine, a blender. And uh, yeah, just to have a, a little naughty treat. Well, not that naughty. It is keto. A lovely keto, um, what's it called? Tiramisu cake. Oh, that coffee mm. walnut. Yeah, coffee walnut, um, keto, coffee walnut, tiramisu, whatnot. There you go. And having a naughty uh, coffee as well. A little bit of a rifferto, some of the fake baileys, or the feelies, I guess you could call it, fake fakies, fakies. <laughs> and uh, a dollop of cream and some coffee, absolutely delicious. Mm. Cheers. Anyway, just going out for our walkie walk now, so I'll catch up with you on the way. Ooh, check it out, guys. Just left for our walk. Absolutely freaking cracky day. Check it out. Lovely uh, blue sky, trees. And cars and wonky pavements everywhere. <laughs> anyway, we're just probably heading up to the beach. So you know, guys, Treasure Island. I used to go all the time when I was a little kid. Now we're just heading up this far down here. Up to the beach. Lovely stony beach. Very different to tyre beaches. Wow, oh, check it out, guys. Just got to the beach. Look at that. The sea looks absolutely amazing today. How awesome does that look? Wicked. Oh man, that's awesome. Take a couple of photos. I don't think it's a scout fortress, I forgot the very name, it's all barred off. It used to be like a museum in here. I don't know if they're renovating it or not. That's a shame, I used to be cool in there. And uh, yeah, we continue this. Uh, if you near me, it's a little bit windy. We continue this way and check it out. We've got the pier, the awesome pier, which burned down a few years ago, so there's nothing in the middle, unfortunately. Seagulls, they're friggin' savages. They rip the food right out your bloody hand. <laughs> there you go. Check them out, they're friggin' the size of pterodactyls. Let's check out guys, he's born here. This middle section down here got burnt down a few years ago. It used to be like the arcade and that. back guys to check it out this roof is protected by anti-climb paint <laughs> you can't climb up there because of the paint that's hilarious <laughs> oh. just come back from our walk and whatnot and uh, yeah just getting dinner ready now here's the what's it called the, the leg of lamb from yesterday just taking off the the meat off of that we're gonna have that nice cold cuts and we've got some of the homegrown potatoes obviously not keto but don't worry about that unless you've got like any medical problems uh, and there's some carrots, had a few carrots here. And here we've got some more homegrown beans. These ones are runner beans. Oh, and check it out, guys. Then here's all the food done. Like I say, got a lovely bit of mixed veg, our runner beans and carrots, mashed potato. Obviously, omit that for strict keto. Use some cauliflower mash, and a bit of lamb. And then we got that lovely chocolate dessert, non keto, very naughty, very naughty. This and some elderflower fizzy water, which mum made as well. Wonderful elderflower from the garden. What do you think? You're not Thai yet. Oh, you're not Thai? I thought you were Thai. Mm. When are you going to be Thai? Mm. <laughs>